let you lead. Oh, my bad. Alright, time to pack up and go home. No. <laughs> Boom, hold on. So before you guys watch the video, I gotta let y'all know something. Long story short, in my previous video, if you guys have not seen it, it is the reveal of my new to me 1997 KX125 two-stroke baby. Super excited for this project series, man. So stay tuned for that. Got another video on that coming very soon. So stay on the lookout. But anyways, man, in my last video, I mentioned about how my SD card snapped in half. I had a lot of footage from 2018. Here is the footage I was able to obtain before I ended up snapping or breaking the SD card. I got a lot of sick footage for the most part. Uh, got some really cool clips. And I'm so glad I was at least able to have this footage because uh, it's pretty sick. So anyways, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Got some more parts coming for the 400EX. Got a lot more updates coming soon. I've uh, been super slacking on the videos lately. So um, hopefully you guys continue watching. And I'm out. Catch you in the next one. Peace. What is going on everyone? It is your boy Rip, man. Back at it again with another video. As you guys can see, man, I'm pretty excited right now. Got my boy Coco, man. My boy Adam, he actually lives just a few houses away from me, man. He's actually helping me work on the 400EX because we're getting ready to go ride on a 4th of July ride, man. I'm super excited. I haven't rode my quad on a trail. Never, bro. I've never ridden this thing. Well, I've ridden it out here where I live, but I've never actually taken it somewhere. So long story short, the problem that we're having, the battery was actually like, uh, um, the wiring to the battery was actually all completely like messed up so we just replaced it with these new clamps um if i'm not using the correct terminology whatever man only other thing that i need to do to the quad is mess with the uh the front brakes because as you can see i'm kind of low on brake fluid on the front so i got some new brake fluid gonna swap it out yeah man we're good on oil and everything else just i just need to mess with the brake fluid and get this battery running and tomorrow we'll be going out to brushy creek i think it's called I need to turn the idle up or something so she don't cut off. Right here, I'm like trying to decide. Uh, should I go down? I don't think he's gonna make it. I was trying to, you know, thinking like, you know, he may not even gonna make it. I know I can make it. I'm like, oh, 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 a little, a little, a little steep, a little bit steeper than I thought. And we gonna see what's up with Adam. Oh. Yeah, it's kind of sketchy. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I, I was I was scared, bro. When I had went halfway up, I was like, oh shit. I hit that bench, and I was like, oh, fuck, I'm fucking flipping. I'm surprised my baby's still running, man. I think you can go around. I'm determined to come
be still running too. I don't know where to go. You might know where to go. I mean. Okay, well, I don't even really give a shit how I look right now. Um, basically, quad is stuck, man. Um, like I was saying before, dude, I'm super tired right now. I'm profusely sweating. <laughs> uh, the back tire is stuck. I got the whole front end to come up. I don't know if I got that on camera or not. But I've been recording for, what, 30 minutes now. Camera's a little bit less than halfway, so I'm probably going to end up stopping in here soon. I think he's trying to figure out how to get back. All right, so Adam just passed me. He's trying to figure out how to get out of here, man. He's trying to go get another strap. I'm going to stay here so that if I need to call out or anything like that, I'm basically stuck out here by myself. Taking it as taking one for the team. I could have rode back with him, but if we don't know how to get back, then it's kind of like my quad just kind of stuck out here. I don't know. We probably would have figured it out. I probably should have went back. I, I want to water really, really bad, but anyways i'm stuck out here for the next 20 minutes until adam gets back <laughs> i feel like that's how long it's gonna take quad stuck i get back to you guys as soon as um i don't know i have an update man i might be out here for the next 20 30 minutes i don't even have my phone on me so um yeah super sketch um other than that trails are great super sick other than my me being dirty it's awesome though i love it man i just i just wish that i wasn't stuck I'd, it'd be way better if i wasn't stuck but hey man as soon as i get out we're back to ripping so i'm gonna cut the camera off so i have enough battery life left and uh yeah man i'm having fun that's all that matters man that's all that matters happy fourth of july man it's your boy rip spread the positive energy man for real that's what i like to do in my videos just spread the positive energy it's super random but hey man when you get stuck in the mud like this and you got no option but to see here you can't be all pissy and pouty about it maybe that's how some of you guys have been in the past i know i've been like that i'm just super pissed off but whatever dude look at me i'm sweating i got mud covered all over me but i'm, I'm chilling man so just waiting for adam to get back and we can get back to ripping man so all right everyone this was insane, man. 4x4, four four, get out of here, man. The, the owner, he got out of here, but just helped me and my buddy get this thing out of here. As you see, man, we got all these freaking logs and whatnot. We literally just drug it through the big old whatever you want to call this, man. Shit. Pile of shit. My, my four-wheeler still has to be push started. So, uh, yeah, that blows. But we finally got it out of here. I think it's been stuck in here for a good old hour and a half. But, uh, yeah, man. <laughs> oh, my gosh, man. Four-wheeler stuck, bro. Guys, come check out the quad, man. Shout out to the owner helping us out, man. Appreciate it. Look at this, bro. Oh, my God. my boots i'm all just covered in mud bro damn dude i need to fix 
this battery. This is crazy, bro. This is ridiculous. I can't even start her up, man. Definitely, definitely, definitely will never go trail riding again without having a battery that'll start. Because that's just no bueno. Oh, almost. Alright, time to pack up and go home. No, <laughs> Hell no. <laughs>